ASFAT, a state-owned leading Turkish defense contractor, has selected SSI Ship Constructor as the engineering and detailed design solution as part of their design support for the Pakistani Navy Jinnah class frigate program. Founded in 2018 as part of the Turkish Ministry of National Defense, ASFAT is responsible for developing, managing, and utilizing the public naval shipyards in Turkey and providing design, construction, sustainment, and training for both Turkish and foreign navies. The Jinnah-class frigate project's needs demanded a solution that could be implemented quickly and return value as soon as possible. The use of SSI solutions also aligns ASFAT with global leaders from the US, Canadian, and other naval and coast guard shipbuilders currently designing, constructing, and delivering vessels for navies. ASFAT was aided in making its decision by SSI's Turkish partner, TECNOR, whose local industry knowledge, shipbuilding experience, and sales and technical support will help ensure a smooth transition for ASFAT. The Jinnah class is a class of multi-role frigates currently under development for the Pakistan Navy. The class is being designed through the expertise gained by Pakistan under the MILGEM project. The Jinnah class frigate is a key part of the Pakistani Navy MILGEM program. Under this program, the Pakistani Navy ordered four new customized multi-mission corvettes based on the Turkish ADA design. However, it also signed on to a joint project with the principal contractor, ASFAT Inc. Military Factor and Shipyard Management, to design, develop, and build an original frigate tailored for the PN's requirements. This frigate is the Jinnah class frigate. Pakistani Navy officials have only recently begun to discuss the Jinnah class frigate in detail. It seems that the Jinnah class frigate is an elaborate project. It involves the transfer of intellectual property, IP, of the Jinnah class frigate to Pakistan while also supporting an upgrade of KSEW to support the project. The original design expertise and IP are crucial pieces. Traditionally, when the Pakistani Navy ordered ships based on transfer of technology tot, agreements, the OEM would supply kits of materiel. In most situations, the OEM likely determined the selection of critical inputs, such as steel and propulsion. However, with the Jinnah class frigate, Pakistan might gain the ability to control more of the cost by choosing the critical input suppliers. So, in theory, it could source the steel through a competitive bidding process, for example. By controlling the design, IP, the Pakistani Navy could potentially even open the tender to domestic suppliers, thereby incentivizing the private sector to develop indigenous alternatives.